The family of Tyree Nichols says they're praying for a just verdict in the trial for three former police officers accused of beating Nichols January 7, 2023. On the witness stand today, a former MPD officer said he lied about the use of force used that night to look out for his family. Action News 5's Jerry Askin joins us live from downtown Memphis now with the very latest. Jerry? Hey, Joe, good evening. Former officer Desmond Mills Jr. said he lied about the assault all to keep his job and support his family. This happening as earlier today, Tyree's family and supporters met here outside the federal building to pray. So God uphold and uplift them. A passionate prayer for justice Wednesday morning as supporters and attorneys joined Tyree Nichols' parents during week three of the federal trial for three former Memphis police officers charged in Tyree's beating death. This is one of the most emotional trials I've ever been involved in. An emotional trial where an emotional apology was given Tuesday by former officer Desmond Mills Jr. about the Scorpion team's actions. Mills testifying he was angry because he pepper sprayed himself by accident. He testified that the officers went too far and then lied about the assault to try and cover it up. Officer Mills, without knowing it, just talked about why we're here. And that's for accountability. Mills, who's already pled guilty to federal charges, said his family was on his mind when he left out vital information regarding Tyree's injuries. Mills testified that MPD has good insurance and his job was vital in supporting his wife and kids, including his special needs child. He also admitted that he took off his body camera, which goes against MPD policy. We still believe that we're going to get systematic police reform in Tyree's name. The family only hopes and prays for one thing, and that is justice for Tyree. Back live here, the defense pushing back today, asking Officer Mills, why didn't he intervene? They also made the point that as far as the officers on the Scorpion team on that arrest scene that night, they say Mills had the most experience. Court resumes first thing tomorrow morning. We're live here in downtown Memphis. I'm Jerry Askin, Action News 5.